Hey everyone and welcome to today's video which I am so excited because I have been waiting for this and it came in the mail. I was asked if I could review it from Arteza and I was so excited because Arteza has now come out with their own brand of pencil cases. This pencil case is one of the two variants. Right now there's only two different types or two different color choices. I'm not sure what their plans are for the future. Also, if I sound different, I'm standing up and I'm like behind the camera because I'm a laptop open over there so I can show you the other, um, the other color. So this one here is the paint splatter. I think that's what it's called on there. It has a nice color and paint all over it. Well, paint on it. And the other one, I you turn you here, is this variant right here which is a black and white pattern. And you can see it has words and letters all over it. And <clears throat> as you can see there on the price, these retail for $18.99. Currently, I believe they are only available on um, the US website, um, but I'll check as Amazon as well. Because I think sometimes if you live in a different country, you actually order from Amazon, um, from like a different country, and it'll ship to yours. You can ship it, of course. Um, but this is the case here. And the details about it in the description it has 64 elastic slots, and the slots hold three pencils each. And this case holds up to 205 pencils, which is true. Inside here are 196 pencils, which are, it's a, that is about, I think 20 more? No, it's about 30 more than the um, pencil cases you can get off of Amazon that look like. Pencil cases that look like this off of Amazon and that open up like this. That's 30 more pencils that fit in here. And you also have a front pouch here, which, if you want to, you can probably slide a few more pencils in there and get that 205. And then it has durable design. Each case features strong metal zippers, which that is very true. You have Nice big zippers with the Arteza logo, which is nice because once again, comparison. The other zippers are just these plain regular zippers that you'd find like on like a jacket or something. These are a little bit more sturdy and like heavy duty and this has like some weight to it. Let's see. It has sturdy polyester fabric to prevent damage while traveling. That is, I think, was one of the biggest pluses for me when I pulled this out with the bag. It came in like a little plastic bag in the box. <clears throat> this has almost like a, you hear it have a design, like it's kind of like the polyester. It's kind of almost like how <clears throat> like school bags, like the backpacks would be. This I am not worried about, like say if something that's spilled on it or anything that I can kind of take a wet washcloth and wipe it off with some Windex and a rag. And I don't feel like <clears throat> if I have to, because I live in a hurricane area, we had to evacuate. I don't think that if this is put into like a box, like very fast or in a bag, that this would get cut open or damaged. Where this case here, I'm just going back for reference, is very squishy. And if this gets cut open, it's not gonna be very it's, it's not gonna be very pretty basically. You should have to like tape it up and everything. Where this is like a cloth, so it's not gonna be like it's it's gonna be more durable, you know, that's what I'm trying to say. Right, so it has Homer pencils, this first sort of case is perfect for storing and organizes or or holds more than pencils, I should say that's what it reads. Has this versatile case is perfect for storing and organizing your pens, markers, and even makeup. So you can actually use it as like a makeup brush as well, like a brush bag, as well as many small palettes as well. You probably 
don't know if it's a pad is smaller than this. I'd say if it didn't have these hinges, this would fit in there. And then the other one has additional pocket for holding extra supplies, which is right here on the front. And it has a nice velcro. It is pretty deep and it comes out pretty far. So in this, I'd put like. <clears throat> If I was to actually go in somewhere or go in or with it, I'd put in like my Tosca pen, my eraser, and my makeup brush I use to wipe away dust. You can see it's still Velcro's. I'm going to go ahead and take it out because these things are very temperamental. Side so note, you actually bang or drop my floor can break. So now we got into the fact that let's open it up. So you have two zippers. I have them off to the side. Um, if I store it in, um, I'm gonna get little um, labels for it. So you open it up, and then it goes flat. Oops, I'm not all the way unzipped. There we go. And it opens up just like this. As you can see, it has the three in here. Now, I will say I was a little worried about that at first, but these are very, very strong, meaning that if I take one pencil out, let's see where I can set this little fall. If I set one of these pencils out and, you know, move it, they didn't move. Take one or two out. It's not going anywhere. So these bags are very, very strong. So you don't have to worry about your pencils falling out. Also, if you have children, if they accidentally do is take a case and fling it across the room, as sometimes children do, they won't fall out everywhere. Where the other pencil case I had just shown you before, the other one, some of them are tight, some of them are loose after uses, so. And they never came this tight. The only problem I would say with this I have is this part right here, until you get it broke in, it's very stiff down here. You can see there's almost a binding here. So when you're trying to get one of these out, it's like you have to kind of pull back a little bit. So it's not like, like a super fast pull this color out and go. That's my only downside to this. That's actually the only downside to this whole case. And as you see it has here, and you get a little sneak peek in tomorrow's review. Because this adds a 120 watercolors. So this is the 120 set right here. And this is my older 72 set of watercolors. And I'm still having one slot down here on the side. So you can see it has these three slots throughout. And then on the top and bottom, you get these kind of like single one over here. So you can put like your blender pencil here or in here. So you have like one single slot. So that's the case, and then of course, you just pull this part out, make sure it's flat. Do it like that, make sure it's all in there. And it zips quickly up. You can store it right on your shelf. Just like that, it stands perfectly up. So this already said retails for both of these um, designs retails on the US Arteza website <clears throat> for $18.99. Now, let me pause really quick. So the pencil case I was comparing this to on Amazon would retail for about $24.99. So that is $6 cheaper. Holds 30, uh, 30 more pencils, and the nice thing about this is um, RT's website also does offer free shipping. So, if you are thinking maybe shipping would add up too much, you have Amazon Prime, this will also be free shipping on the RT's website. So, it still equals out to about $18.99 plus your sales tax. <clears throat> so, overall. Definitely an amazing case. I will be purchasing probably a few more of this and with my own money in January because I really want to get another set. 
I think that she's gonna be really nice by having your Arteza pencils and Arteza pencil case. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and probably purchase one or two more, probably one more for my Arteza 120s, the regular pencils, and then my 72s and put them in here just like I did this with the watercolor. And then um, I had another pencil case for my other rest of spare ones, and my order one or two for my mom because she needs pencil cases as well. So yeah, definitely recommend them. They are really amazing. It's sturdy. I don't think that it's gonna be one of the cases that you use for a month and it's dead. I definitely think it's really sturdy. Also, I forgot to mention it, but I should show you. These are sewn in. You can see it here, double stitched. And it's very, very sturdy. So even if you're flipping back, and I say you actually pull it, it's not gonna be falling out or falling off. Like hinges or anything like that. So I definitely, definitely recommend that. I rate these the full five stars on the Arteza website. And down below, you'll find links to the Arteza website for this one here and the black and white model. Um, just as you should know, because I have to tell you that, because uh, everyone who links stuff like that has to tell you. It is going to be a affiliate link. If you search or you, if you shop through my link, you it's, you are charged nothing. It's basically just like me doing a small kickback for advertising for them. So I have to, you have to um, say that and I have it out there. So you're not kind of like sneakily doing it, you know, type of thing. But, um... It is an affiliate link to this one and the black and white one I showed you. So yeah, that's it for today. You'll definitely be seeing me get a few more of these. I really like how they feel. They're very sturdy. So yeah, that's it for today. I hope you all enjoyed this quite quick review because I really don't know how to do full in-depth reviews of a pencil case. If you have any more questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments below and I'll try my best to answer them to the best of my ability. So that is it for today. I hope you all enjoyed this video. The links to this will be down in below. And I'll have the links to them when they are on the UK website down below as well. For right now, it's just US links. So that is it for today. Really amazing day. And until next time, happy coloring.